Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, you guys, peep game. Got the rental car. Then packed up. About to head to Vegas. So, you know what I'm saying? Big things coming tomorrow. It seemed like more attention getting paid to this fight than I thought. At first, this was just what you called, you know, a fly-by fight, you know, for Manny Pacquiao. But it seems to be a lot of people got their eyes on this fight because they think if Manny Pacquiao or or even Adrian Broner should prevail, shit, they see some big fights down the line. You know, a lot of people are rooting for Manny Pacquiao to win because, of course, there's still people that's delusional that think that Manny Pacquiao will beat Floyd Mayweather in a rematch. You know, uh, Manny Pacquiao got beat decisively by Floyd Mayweather. And a lot of people that j just won't accept it, and particularly white people because and Filipinos because Manny Pacquiao was the adopted white hope. Now, a lot of white people say they didn't have nothing at stake when Manny Pacquiao fought Floyd Mayweather. Yes, it was. It was to see the black fighter lose. So that's what you had at stake. You know what I'm saying? A lot of these people want to play these games and shit and try to say, hey, you know, you know, we just don't like Floyd and all that type of shit, man. Yeah, right. We know what time it is, man. I'm just keeping it 100. You know, people get mad at me because, like I said, I speak the truth. And they don't like for me to talk about touchy subjects and shit because you got a lot of clowns and shit and coons and shit on YouTube that wants you to talk a certain narrative that fits them because they too chicken shit to talk about the shit because they want a wide audience. Well, if I have to compromise myself to get a wide audience, then fuck you. Basically, fuck all y'all. Like I told you, I ain't changing for shit. But anyway, like I said before, I'm gonna try to have a lot of coverage of this fight tomorrow. You know, I'm gonna be working hard. Basically, I'm trying to get to the hotel as quick as possible uh it's around 12 20 you know i will be touching the freeway at exactly around 12 27 and i'm about to smile up to las vegas so hopefully it shouldn't be no traffic basically i should be able to get to las vegas in a hot skip and a jump really because i'm i don't fuck around when i drive so basically uh i'm stopping for gas maybe once and like i said i'm trying to get there hopefully uh, hopefully I get to Vegas by like uh, around 8 o'clock you know what I'm saying hopefully but nevertheless man I'll get it y'all later I'm out